It is said that courage is not the absence of fear, but the triumph over it. Times of war reveal many extraordinary acts of courage, some recorded for history, others lost to time. This is the story of how one man's selfless act of courage earned him a Congressional Medal of Honor and made him a legend. That man was Forrest Lee Vosler. When the United States entered World War II, Vosler enlisted into the Army Air Forces as a radio operator and reported to Scott Air Force Base, Illinois, for instruction. Vosler eventually found himself assigned to the air crew of a B-17 for a full-scale attack on enemy territory. 500 Allied bombers departed on December the 20th, 1943 and soon engaged German fighters. Vosler's B-17 was able to reach its target but sustained heavy damage and dropped out of the formation. Already injured, Vosler was able to shake off his fear, man the single 50 caliber machine gun at the radio hatch, and return fire. He continued until a 20 millimeter shell exploded in his face, peppering him with shrapnel wounds and sending shards of metal into both of his eyes. Barely able to see, Vosler returned to his damage radio, which he repaired by touch. He then sent an SOS that led search and rescue teams to their position. Once the B-17 ditched, Vosler crawled out and in a selfless act of courage, jumped to the starboard wing to keep the unconscious tail gunner from slipping into the freezing water below. Vosler held on to his injured comrade until rescue teams arrived, and both men survived. President Franklin D. Roosevelt awarded the Courageous Radio Man the Medal of Honor. The final line of his award citation reads, that the extraordinary courage, coolness, and skill he displayed in the face of great odds when handicapped by injuries that would have incapacitated the average crew member were outstanding. Vosler passed away in 1992 and was buried at Arlington National Cemetery. His medals were donated to the U.S. Air Force Enlisted Heritage Institute, where they remain on display to inspire a new generation of American airmen and potential heroes.